The danger of law enforcement is one reason that 80% of this country's police departments are having trouble recruiting. Jeff Pegues has been looking into the thinning blue line. Philadelphia is one of several big cities struggling to find recruits. How you doing? Hi, how are you? The police department is about 200 officers short. Right now, policing is not the most attractive occupation that they could probably get into. Commissioner Charles Ramsey says relatively low pay and tougher application requirements combined with high profile police incidents from Cincinnati to Baltimore and Ferguson are having a negative impact. Is there the same amount of pride that there was 10, 20, years ago. Well, I think uh, police officers are proud of what they do, but I think that that doesn't mean that they're, they haven't been hurt a bit by the images that have been, um, you know, shown repeatedly and the betrayal of police as if it just paints us all with one brush. It's got to hurt a little bit. Does I mean, that hurt you? Yeah, sure it does. In 2008, Philadelphia recruited 357 new officers. Last year, that number dropped by nearly half to 190. Across the country, major cities like New York and Los Angeles have seen a significant drop in the number of applicants. Rookie officers Michelle Kustro and Jessica Miskoski say they joined the Philadelphia police to make a difference. But didn't you see the, the images on TV? You're always going to see a story of a corrupt cop or somebody did something they shouldn't have, but there's so many good cops out here, and that kind of goes unspoken sometimes. And it's the good cops who Commissioner Ramsey says deserve more attention. They should hold their head high. They should be proud of what they do because what they do makes a difference. It makes a huge difference. When it comes to recruiting, Commissioner Ramsey says his greatest challenge is attracting black and Hispanic officers. Scott, according to the Department of Justice, the national percentage of black officers has been stagnant at about 12 percent since 2007. Jeff Begay is reporting for us this evening. Jeff, thank you.